Hi, Gemini. Welcome in, and thank you so much for joining. Also, thank you guys for hitting the like button as it does help support my channel. Be sure to only take messages that resonate and how they resonate for your situation. Energies can be reversed. If the messages are not for you, check your other signs or check back next time. For those of you who would like to skip ahead to the singles portion or the cross watchers portion, there are timestamps located in the description box. We're going to start with the person you have history with, Gemini. What are the messages for Gemini? I'm getting uh, something didn't follow through. No follow through. Could have been connecting with the Taurus. So there was an ending here or, you know, somebody here didn't follow through with their commitments due to um, like not giving enough effort to a situation. Yeah, I see you moving on though. I see you moving on from somebody. What you don't know at the bottom of the deck, they keep tabs on you. Tell me more about this, please. The person Gemini has history with. We also have Aries energy. This person misses you, but they're too stubborn to say anything. How does Gemini see this person? You know, I feel like there's a deep history between you two. There, you know, it's, it's, there's a deep history here. You could have been in a commitment with this person, or that's something that, you know, you thought it was leading to that. But I feel like somebody wasn't following through here. Somebody here, you know, had commitment issues. I'm also getting, you see them as the Ten of Swords, someone who betrayed you. Or, you know, this situation was just draining. You see them as someone who drains your energy. You feel temperance, Sagittarius energy. I feel like you're healing, Gemini. You're healing from this person. Or you are healed. Take what resonates, okay? We're all on different timelines, but this is a situation that I do see you healing from. If you haven't already. Yeah, look at that. Three of Wands. I just see you kind of moving on to the next thing. Or you already have moved on to the next thing. Uh, it just is you moving on. Possibly from an Aquarius, okay? Or to an Aquarius. But we have Aquarius, Aries, Sagittarius. We did have Taurus as well. So how do they see Gemini right now? Gemini, I feel like your life has calmed down since this ending. Things have gotten a lot more calm for you, or they will. I also feel like there's an energy here of you being patient for what's next. Okay. How do they see Gemini right now? How do they see Gemini right now? <laughs> oh, Gemini, they think you look good. They think you're doing really well. This person still has romantic feelings for you. Could be connecting with a Libra or a Taurus. You know, they do see you as a divine counterpart. Somebody that was meant to be in their life. Judgment. It's like this person waking up. Or it's like this person, you know, they're waking up to the truth or they finally see something that they didn't see before. Okay. And so they see you as someone who was truly meant to be in their life. And I'm getting something, Gemini, they're very attracted to your appearance. Okay. That's standing out big time this, you know you could be somebody that it doesn't matter all right it doesn't matter but i you know i'm just getting someone who's very attracted to the way you look 
the way you carry yourself, the way you talk. So how do they feel? How do they truly feel about Gemini right now? How do they truly feel about Gemini spirit? They want you. They feel like you're their dream person. You're, you're their dream girl or you're their dream man, their dream woman, whatever. Okay. But they feel like you're exactly what they want and they miss you. Ace of Cups, guys, this person's in love with you still. Somebody is still in love with you, but you're telling me they drained your energy, your healing, and you're moving on. You know, this Mercury retrograde really has this person in their feelings. Thinking a lot about the past, okay? I feel like there could be some... I do see the, the mutual energy of the Six of Cups. I do feel like, you know, you are experiencing some type of nostalgia here as well, but... You're continuing to move forward. And you have somebody here that's in love with you. That drained your energy. The lovers for what you don't see. That this person thinks you were truly meant to be in their life. What do they want from Gemini? What do they want from Gemini? Spirit, what do they want from Gemini? They want to get to a better place with you. Clarify that. They're very confused. Okay, Pisces energy. They want to come out of the dark. They want to come out of the state of confusion. They know that you're pushing them away. Or that you did push them away. Pisces energy. What do they like about Gemini? The lovers. Oh. They like the way you talk. They like your personality, the communication. Um, I'm getting something about direct. They liked how direct you were with your communication. That you had aspirations and goals that you may have communicated to this person. They're also telling me there's an energy here of you believing in them at one point. When no one, like, I feel like they've never experienced the fact that they've never experienced people, someone believing in them. But it, you just haven't, you, you have like this genuine uh, personality. They also liked the way you made them feel, okay, when you talked. The things that, like, I'm getting an energy of someone hanging on your every word in the past. For a lot of you guys, uh, this is, if you've had sex with this person, they really liked that. A lot. Okay, so what are their next actions towards Gemini? Queen of Swords. To talk to you directly. Someone wants to speak directly to you. Okay, they want to have direct communication with you here, Gemini. Let's see what's their hidden truth. Could be dealing with a Libra, Taurus, Aries, another Gemini, a Pisces, a Sagittarius, possible an Aquarius. What's their hidden truth? That they don't want to let you go? That they felt really happy with you? The happiest they've ever felt? And that they truly do feel like you are meant to be with them? Gemini? Okay, we're going to take a look at the singles. Okay. 
So my single Geminis, again, you can get to the timestamp in the description box to get past the shuffling. Okay, let's see. towards my single Geminis and we're also going to see what's coming in let's see who is coming towards single Gemini I gotta tell you this seems like a common theme for the singles this weekend and this week guys okay uh, people being stuck in their own self-made prisons okay People feeling insecure, uh, people holding themselves back, uh, and it's because of the current astrology. And the person coming towards you, Gemini, they are keeping themselves in a state of restriction. We'll clarify it. Now, I will tell you, there is a past person for you singles that is really missing you. But there's also a new person coming towards you guys. Um, let's see, what's coming in for Gemini? What's coming in for Gemini? Besides love, what's coming in for Gemini? What is coming in for Gemini? A breakthrough? So there's a breakthrough in communication if you've been waiting on communication, but I'm also getting there's a breakthrough in success, okay? I also feel like you guys are going to get a lot of clarity. Um, in the next coming of like the next couple of days with what it is you want to do with your time um but there's a breakthrough in success so why let's go back to this person why are they the eight of swords emperor aries energy they're just really stubborn i feel like this person has a hard time expressing their emotions um they don't want anything getting too close They want to come across as someone who's very stable and in control of themselves, and they may be stable financially, but they're not stable emotionally, just so you know. Your thoughts, um, you want the truth, you feel like this person is imbalanced and too much work. Yeah, you don't want to re repeat any past mistakes. I think a lot of you guys are thinking about the cause and effect of being with someone like this. So your intuition is telling them, telling you that you don't want to get yourself emotionally involved with someone who is draining. And I feel like you guys see this person that's coming towards you as draining. They're very confused by you, Gemini. I feel like someone is sexually attracted to you, but they're emotionally confused. Somebody could also be sexually confused. Okay, especially if they're a fire sign. Ugh, they want to connect with you, though, guys. This person is not quite sure what they want, and I am getting a message of someone being confused with their sexuality, so just something to be aware of. But I will say they're wanting a relationship with you, and they're wanting to connect on a deep, deeper level, but they have a hard time actually allowing themselves to feel feelings. And what I'm getting here is uh, I do see a reconciliation happening between you and another person, but the new person that's coming in, I will say that this person is non-committal and they don't know what they want, Gemini. Judgment at the bottom of the deck. Make sure you're using discernment when dealing with this person because, again, I feel like this person is sexually confused. And um, that is for most of you. Now, I'm also getting a message. They're just confused in general with what they want. I feel like you will be picking up on the energy of the specifics of this. And that you need to trust your intuition. Those of you that were ghosted by somebody, I do see somebody coming back in to ask for your forgiveness. We're 
going to do cross watchers portion. Aries through Pisces. Remember to only take messages that resonate. Aries through Pisces, please. If you are dealing with an Aries, this Aries wants to come back into your life. This Aries is very unpredictable. If you're dealing with a Taurus, they want to communicate. They're still interested. If you're dealing with another Gemini, they want to take action. Very aroused by you, Gemini. If you're dealing with a Cancer, this Cancer is feeling, is feeling drained. Okay, they want to give up on the situation. They're still hurt. If you're dealing with a Leo, this Leo would like to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation with you. This Leo likes you back. Just as much as you like them, they like you. If you are dealing with a Virgo, they would like to reunite, come together. Some of you guys, if it's a new Virgo, they just want to date you. They want to take you out. If you're dealing with a Libra, they're walking away. Okay, this, this Libra is trying to find themselves. And this Libra is... I just feel like the situation is disappointing. Okay. Um, but it is telling me this Libra is trying to find themselves. They could be walking away from a job situation as well. I'm getting specifically. But they're hold, they're held back emotionally. If you're dealing with a Scorpio, this Scorpio is really feeling a deep connection with you. They want you. If you are dealing with a Sagittarius, this Sagittarius is very secretive. Okay, they're also they're they're just confused in general by the connection with you, Gemini. There's some fears that Sagittarius has, okay, surrounding your connection. If you're dealing with a Capricorn, this Capricorn is stubborn and emotionally closed off. If you are dealing with an Aquarius, let's see, this Aquarius is still hung up on some type of betrayal, okay, or some type of, like, hurt. I feel like this Aquarius is... You know, wanting wanting to just let go, but they can't. They can't let go. They're, they're they want to, but they're unable to let go of whatever happened here. If you're dealing with a Pisces, this Pisces would like to offer you uh, some some form of love here. Yeah, they're thinking about their next steps. I see someone wanting to message you, Gemini. That is a Pisces. Those are your messages. Um, if they didn't resonate with you, check your other signs. It's not going to resonate with you every single time. So just keep that in mind, Gemini. Um, if you like my style, I do appreciate you hitting that like button. Until next time, bye.